folks, what is up and welcome to Ace Attorney with an Actual Lawyer. I'm your host, Zach, joined by our voice actor, Wes. And our actual lawyer, Bridge. Hello. With, uh, just in case, this might be your first time watching us play this franchise. Uh, in which case, welcome. We do this uh, every week, usually on twitch.tv slash save data team. If you want to watch us live, interact with our chat, follow us there, please. We'd really appreciate that. But we post uh, edited videos on YouTube every Monday and Tuesday of this uh, with a, uh, a list of highlighted clips and edits that I make. Uh, that'll be in the pinned comment down below for your enjoyment at a later date. Uh, but go there, follow us there, and if you can, support us on patreon.com slash save data team where you can get yourself a bunch of uh, bonus benefits, including... At the $10 level, where you will get your name included in this Patreon song. Thank them, thank them, gotta thank them all. Gotta thank them all, our Patreons. Burger Bun, Mr. Cola Bun, Andy Cosmo, Cud, Dave Paul, Lucha, and Sofino. HSM, Earn Less, Crow Knight, Danny, Ant Lester, Kevin Nation, Shadow, Navi. Witch Tower, Sky, Herlock, Hyde, Safaria, Arky, Forensic, Beckmick, Cole, JFJ, Mystic, Woody. Leprechaun, Jacob Bell, Go Go, Zeppeli, Sheber, Steam Riger, Rila Jolie, Baron Esper, BBC, What and Sherlock, Mr. Mokasil, Arts, Ami, Borshock. Mini is super cool, Chrissy, Buck, Dustin, Mari, Diego, Garcia, Charlie, and Boomer, Emily. Mega Zero, Big Kerbo, Who Needs to Sleep, Aleya, Yakta, Est, Ever, Entropy, Daedric, and Serafina, Maho, Stars, The Driver, 458, Tasty Morabar, Jack Warner, Taco Sensei, QB, Nagashi, Anime, Chick, The Jester, Aruka, Naegi, Desert Boy Man, Elijah Sly, Rick, Rats, Katja, Traveling in a Box, and Snowcat, Conjuring, Scribe, Zeal, Croissant, Fulfilla, Written Word, Chain the Punisher, Sevilla, Thank him, thank him, gotta thank him all, gotta thank him all, our Patreon. But folks, with let's that go. all out of the way, let's start the game. Let me turn my background music off. <laughs> I forgot that wow. it was called Turn That's... About Trump. <laughs> I knew that it was called this, and I still forgot about it. And People, this <laughs> case is the greatest case <laughs> in Ace Attorney history. Huge. The say. viewer turnout is going to be huge. This is, huge there are viewers. so many, we are the uh, premier the Ace Attorney streamers. <laughs> There's so many people watching, Every, all said, the best people said, are tuning into this stream get, right now. They said they couldn't get over 500 viewers. We got over 500 viewers because <laughs> so we couldn't do it, but, but we did it. They we said, did it. they said we couldn't get over 500. Guess what? We got over 10 billion viewers. <laughs> 10 billion we, viewers. There has never been a YouTube live stream with these kind of numbers. <laughs> Incredible. I'm very excited for editing that in some way, shape, sleepy, or form. Sleepy Mr. Beast. <laughs> sleepy Mr. Beast. That's really good. Wow. Wow. People in the chat are saying, make great Ace Attorney. <laughs> we already did that. <laughs> See, see, yeah, I, we people making the one. Magatama joke. I made that before, and that was a good joke, and I stand by that. Oh yeah, we anyways, did. I remember Magatama. Oh shit, is the game gonna be too quiet? Art. Oh no, it's just, it's just quiet. There's not sound. <gasps> now there's sound. Uh... This is a really cool visual effect. Oh yeah. Showdown time! <laughs> People don't know <laughs> this gimmick. I feel sorry for them. No, we did Swedish guy. We did Swedish uh, guy. Uh, no, oh, yeah. yeah. People just watching oh, for the yeah. first time. No. Oh shit. You know what? Oh god, what was that game called? Apollo Justice. I think that was the one, yeah. I seem to be in the bait of trouble. Something like that. <laughs> Dead. Someone hit him hard. Me, please. The cops should be here any minute. I'm in your hands. Should it come to that? <laughs> ah, it's a poker club in Sweden. Mm -hmm. They love. It is the it is, it is the poker capital of Sweden. 
<laughs> Sweden. <laughs> yeah. Uh, also, look at the look at the portrait. I was just saying that's different. Yeah. Yeah. What? It looks like Gandhi with a big old beard. It looks beard. like Gandhi if Gandhi was combined with the judge. Yeah. I don't know why, but I thought you were going to say the judge. <laughs> I mean, Gandhi did. Gandhi famously did say we live in a society, so. <laughs> Why, for, like for whatever reason, I was certain you were going to say it's like God. Holy oh shit, God. God, guys! I just pointed out it's. It is April twentieth in the game. Are you fucking kidding me? Best game ever. Finally, the part where we get to see Apollo. <laughs> Apollo shows it. up, just blazed out of his mind <laughs> to what I'm assuming right. is his first case ever. That that's why you get yeah. the tutorial because no, he's it's, just fucking losing it. No, it's 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 a it's Apollo's like hundredth case. Oh. He's just so fucking he blitzed. Forgets. He can't remember how to be a lawyer. <laughs> that's really good. Oh, okay. <coughs> You're right, and he is, and he's fine. Uh, now, time to find out. Does he start by saying I'm Apollo Justice and I'm fine? That's the only thing I know about this character mo for the most part. All right, well, let's find out. Oh, okay. <clears throat> oh, he's no, he's a rapper. Fuck. Yeah. Palms are sweaty. There is vomit <laughs> on his sweater already. Mom's spaghetti. Oh. Panicked. All right. Palms sweaty. Zach, hit us with that legally distinct main I can admit voice. it. I'm nervous. Ah, good morning. Swedish guy. Good, good morning, sir. You look tense, Justice. Wound up tight? Wound up, sir? No! I'm loose! I'm fine! I hate that. Do you want to check how loose I am? I swear! Here, look! That screeching noise. Is that your voice? I suppose it's to be expected. <laughs> Your first trial, and it's a homicide. I guess justice doesn't start small, eh? I, I'm fine! I got up at 5 a.m. to do my Chords of Steel workout! I'm fine! <coughs> ah, that explains I'm also, it. real life, a little sick today, so... We'll see how much I'm gonna do this yelling. <laughs> I'm fine. <laughs> I did detect a certain rasping quality. Hey, look at speech. that! It fits perfectly. <laughs> Me being sick. <laughs> <laughs> I overdid it again. As you know, your client today is a good friend of mine. I wouldn't want to let him down. If you get also, uh, chat, please let me know if I'm peeking my microphone at all, because that would be terrible to find in the edit. Drift gotten, sir! I'm I'm all over that drift! Tokyo style! <laughs> as it happens, I dined with him the night of the murder. We can't let this case fall through. Yes! Yes! I'm fine, sir! Uh, one more thing. <laughs> Don't say you're fine quite so much. <laughs> People might take you the wrong way. <laughs> I'll be preparing our case. You might want to introduce yourself to the client. My name is Apollo Justice. If it isn't clear already, I'm a new attorney. I'm, I'm fine. fine. <laughs> And today is my first trial. Not that I'm worried or anything, Baka. The defendant has been accused of murder. No way. Yeah, I'm really fucking shocked over that, you know. My boss <laughs> wants to help him out, of course, and so do I. I mean, there's no way he did it. Not him. No way. Who is it? Whoa! Genuinely? <laughs> Didn't realize they pulled him in this early. 
Uh huh. Kind of, kind of thought he was gonna be safe for like the finale case of the game, and that was like a fun tie-in. But wait a minute, wait a minute. Who is this? It's not. You can't do Swedish for this character. <laughs> like, no, I don't. I, we don't know who it mm -hmm. is yet. This it could, could be, be anybody. anybody. You're absolutely right. We've never seen this character in yeah, art before I've, or anything. I have never seen. No. I have never seen a guy with this hat uh -huh, and this uh -huh. jacket on. Uh, yeah, also get excited for my slightly older daddy mode Phoenix voice, everybody. Whoa! Good, uh, morning! Morning. Morning! No. no. <laughs> <laughs> it's all up to you today. First trial. Nervous? Meeting him? Cardiac arrest! I... Think I'm supposed to say something. Uh, help? So, you're fine! I, I'm fine! Uh, Mr. Fine, is it? Uh, I <laughs> did remember you having an odd name. Well, we're off to a great start. Um, are you sure you're okay? I mean, with me. Mr. Gavin is a top-notch defense attorney, and he's your friend, so why? You'll see. Uh, Turned down my mind. You can do it. Be confident. Um, I... I'm really sorry this happened to you. I mean... I mean, I... It's time. Shall we? Yes, sir! Damn. Okay, I need to focus. First trial. Here comes justice. The justice. Kind of funny. We're so used to like. I was laughing how like again, Phoenix Wright's name is slightly ridiculous, but we get used uh -huh. to it. And now I have to do the fact that Apollo Justice's name is actually more ridiculous. It really is. And I can't. And, I, and it's gonna take me a long time to get used it's to the... it. His name is. Even more anime absurd than Phoenix it's a, Wright is Apollo. It's it's Justice. a pretty bonkers name. Uh, I do like it though. I do like it though. All right, here we go into the courtroom. Oh fuck! Of course they have a pain. Of course. Uh, yeah, he's back. Let's hello. go. Uh, how I I missed you, old friend. <laughs> I honestly think the judge is probably one of my favorite. I mean, you're only biased because he's your grandpa, he's... but that's yeah, true. I do love my grandpa. The court is now in session. The prosecution is ready, Your Honor. Uh, the defense is uh fine. I, I mean, ready, Your Honor. <sighs> Mind going blank. Don't panic. Uh, too late. Your name was. <laughs> Mr. Justice? That's a bit ridiculous, huh? <laughs> and this is your first trial? I yes, Your Honor, but I'm fine, really! You know, I'm pretty sure if you keep saying that, <laughs> that's gonna make me think less that you're fine. Are you quite sure? Your voice sounds a bit it strained. It is! <coughs> <clears throat> Mr. Gavin. Yes, Your Honor. I was under the impression that you would be heading up this case. That was my intention, yes. However, a defense attorney must always cede to his client's wishes. And my client specifically requested Mr. Justice. Well, of course. Well, of course he wants oh, justice. Judge, make, judge is making jokes out here. But to entrust his case to this greenhorn, <laughs> why? I do not exaggerate when I say that you're the best attorney, best defense attorney in town, I'll Mr. Get Gavin. Fucked, Marvin Grossberg. <laughs> <laughs> In that town. guy hasn't done a case in years, ever since Fortnite yeah. came out. <laughs> yeah, but who's the best defense attorney around? Mm -hmm. 
Okay, so Gavin's got trial experience, fine. But does he have cords of steel? <coughs> then let's begin. The defendant may enter the courtroom. Who's this guy? <laughs> Who's this smelly hobo? This is truly an unfortunate turn of events. I'm sorry we had to meet again under these circumstances. Long time no see, Mr. Wright. Let's put the past behind us, shall we? These days, I'm Damn. merely Phoenix Wright's piano player. <laughs> Ugh, I just can't. I just can't help but like you when you say cool yeah. <laughs> one-liners like that. All right, not guilty. Mr. Wright, how could this have happened? I won't speak of it further, then. If the prosecution would be so kind as to explain the charges, Mr. Payne. To think, I saw you enter this room a fresh attorney, and now I'll see you leave in chains. Ah, Winston Payne. Subtle as ever, I see. Ahem! Ooh. The crime occurred at the Borscht Bowl Club, a Russian restaurant. Music's kind of fun. I'm into it. it oh, Apollo Justice, I, I honestly think, has my favorite yeah. soundtrack in Ace Attorney. I love Apollo That's Justice. That's good. Music. The the hot hot take the turn the the pursuit theme in Apollo is my favorite of all of them. I'm excited Hello. to hear it. The defendant Phoenix Wright took the victim, a customer, and he hit him, wham, on the head, smack, killed him cold. Hmm. So you say he hit him, wham, and smoosh. <laughs> No, no, no. <laughs> Smack! Oh, yeah. Well, that changes things. A customer at the restaurant, you say? And the defendant, you say he was... Uh, the pianist for the club, it what seems. What did you call me? <laughs> I called you a penist. <laughs> Phoenix, right? A penis? <laughs> Oh, we're at 612. Holy shit. Yeah, what's up, everybody? We crossed 600 concurrence. That's fucking bonkers. Yeah, that's like double our Yeah, I think our, our pretty much. Why is, a, why is a game with murder not allowed to mention alcohol? Uh, Pridge, Pridge, this is... <laughs> it's so Pridge, weird. this is a thing where our chat will tell you on this. This is actually a joke. Shu Takami was like, I, yeah. I think it's funny if it's grape juice. This is in the original. Okay, you know what? Good on him. Good on him, yeah, man. Yeah. Fine. Yeah. This is the weapon. I respect that, man. <laughs> this is the weapon that took the victim's life. A bottle of grape juice. Grape juice is apparently our defendant's drink of choice. <laughs> the court accepts the deadly bottle as evidence. <laughs> Ooh, Deadly bottle of great of grape juice. <laughs> <laughs> Something to note, Justice. All evidence is filed in the court record. Make a practice of oh, checking. Yeah. It you know, somehow I forgot that they were going to tutorialize this on this. The court record, right? I've heard of that. <laughs> Use the court record button to look at the evidence so far. I'm confident in your ability to handle this. Right. The court record button. Sounds like it's time for some hands-on action. So, the victim was a customer at this restaurant. But just who was this, uh... Shoddy Smith Is the pun fellow? supposed to be Shady <laughs> yeah, Smith? Yo, this no. kid fucks. Wait, is, it, is that Smith Shady? <laughs> Will the real Smith Shady please That's very good. Up? Yo, this, this, this he's, he's pretty cool, actually. We believe he was a traveler, Your Honor. A traveler? Is that a That's, that's not, not a, a career, job, no. Is it? Please, I went to college for actually, traveling. Actually, 
Actually, in the dawn of the new social media age, <laughs> being a traveler is actually a job now. People will pay you money to just go places and then eat their food. According to his passport, he had been out of the country for a number of years. He had only returned to this country recently, though his place of residence is unclear. And, and what country is this again? <laughs> <laughs> Very good. Very good. And he had some sort of connection with the defendant? That, too, is unclear at present, Your Honor. We believe they first met at the Borscht Bowl Club on the night of the crime. If they'd only just met, then why murder? Why not just harm? <laughs> Perhaps the victim slighted the defendant's piano playing? <laughs> That's really funny. You... Oh, I kind of I kind of oh, hope it was. <laughs> what the fuck did you say you to me? That. <laughs> he just jumps down off the piano and bashes the dude. <laughs> that doesn't appear to have been the case. No, the motive had nothing to do with the defendant's lack of playing skill. At least not piano playing. I'll let this photo explain what I mean. Okay, they're playing cards. That guy's just uh -huh. napping. I know. Oh, look at him. He's, He's just tuckered he, out. Just, that dude's just blackout drunk. <laughs> Listen, if he's a rambling man, <laughs> then he's probably tired from all of his mm -hmm. travels. That's good. Good reference. As we can see, a game of poker was in progress at the scene also, of the crime. Poker? I hardly Very know good. her. Also, what are the odds that you can hit somebody with a bottle so hard that they die, but the bottle doesn't break? Like, that yeah, seems uh, yeah. hard to believe to me. Yeah, you can absolutely kill someone with a bottle, but it would break mm. almost certainly. Well, what is that made of? Right. Wait a second. Isn't poker... Gambling, right. which we're establishing is now illegal uh -huh, in Ace Attorney uh -huh, yeah, World. Yeah. Gambling is canonically illegal in uh, Japan. That's a crime in and of itself. Indeed, it appears our defendant has fallen to become the basest sort of criminal. Okay, let's... I mean, you can technically pay poker without mm -hmm. gambling. Yes, he's quite based. <laughs> it is true that the defendant was engaged in a game of poker with the victim. Yet it was only that. A game, in the purest sense. A competition, Your Honor. A competition? Yes, a test of wits. A silent clash of, pa a silent clash of clans. <laughs> Only the cards, their backs wreathed in blue flame, know its final outcome. Okay, Kristoff. Okay, Kristoff. What, what the uh, fuck does that mean? Come again? The cards on the table had blue backs, Your Honor. I believe the defense was waxing poetic in an attempt to mystify <laughs> those present and impress women. <laughs> what? <laughs> Damn. Did it work? <laughs> I mean, consider me impressed. <laughs> that will be our first order of business here, then. Impress women? To find out how many... <laughs> yeah, <laughs> impress women! <laughs> to find out how many women were impressed by that. With all, with all right, Mr. Here, Gavin. Was anyone here identified as female? I wish to, wish to know whether you were impressed by him waxing Man, poetic. one thing I'm so excited about <laughs> getting back to the uh, original games is that I can do objection.lols for all of our sides again so easily. Oh, I'm so excited to do stupid <laughs> bits. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. That's, my that's not so nice. My, my watch heard me say, I'm so... <laughs> My watch heard me say so easily, I'm excited, you stupid bitch. And my my watch said back, that's not nice. Wow, that's the funniest one I've ever had. Wow. That's not nice. 
Uh, the next case is going to be Zach as the murder victim and Siri as the, as the culprit. To find out more about this fatal game of cards. Did somebody mention card games? No, king of games, get out of here. <laughs> but only if don't wor- titles. Don't worry, Phoenix. I'll fight the Winston Payne in a game of duel <laughs> monsters for your soul. Yeah, you got it, you. <laughs> Very well, defendant. You may start playing duel <laughs> monsters. You will testify to the court about the poker competition held the night of the crime. My pleasure. This is it. My first trial. Here goes nothing. I'm a pianist by trade. Yet, I can hardly play at all. My real job is to take on interested customers over at the poker table. The room where we play and the competition in there are the club's main attractions. The rules are simple. We play a game of poker using two decks of cards. That's all it is. A game. And our customers are happy. Hmm. 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 That's what I was just thinking, Zach. <laughs> a, a penis who can't play piano. <laughs> That's good. <laughs> Better than a defense attorney who can't defend. Wow. Well, got my ass. <laughs> got him, I guess. Very well. The defense may begin the cross examination. Right! Your Honor! My first cross examination. Don't blow it! Are you all right? You're sweating. Bro. Bullets? Where? <laughs> Fucking idiot. It's a figure of speech, Justice. Your voice sounds strained and raspy. It is, too. Christoph. My brain feels strained and raspy, sir. Also, I fucking love Apollo's. It's good. Theme. You've watched me perform cross examinations many times. Though you've never done one yourself, have you? Care for care for a refresher? What to do? Should I ask now, Mr. Gavin for a refresher in uh, refresher course in cross examination? Fuck no! Get that get that shit out of here! We're professional goofballs. No need to help here, sir. I think I've got this one covered. I think you'd better do more than think. You know it. Do or, you do, not. or do not. Do or do not. Yeah. There is no try. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fine! The cords of steel are ready for battle! My weapons, press and present! Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> but that's what I named these two pistols. <laughs> press, press and, and present! present. Uh, Bayonetta's <laughs> guns are... Fuck, what's the Scarborough Fair? Parsley oh, Sabers, I... Marion Time, I think, are the name of Bayonetta's guns? Yeah. Okay, yeah. yeah I, believe, I believe that's what mm-hmm. Scarborough Fair's name are. Find any inconsistencies, any lies in the testimony, and reveal them to the court. That is cross-examination. Learn it. Know it. Pull it. Do it. Twist it. Learn it. Know Bob it. Do it. Bob it. <laughs> inconsistencies. <laughs> lies. Phoenix Wright. Metal Gear. <laughs> Psycho Mantis. As if Phoenix Wright would never Wait. lie, and it's up to me to prove it. Demon King? <laughs> Secret Stone? Very good. The defense may begin the cross examination. Hey. Yeah, let's do it. Let's go. He's a penis. Uh, he can't play. <laughs> I almost want to press it just for the lols, because, like, what the fuck, my guy? What are you even doing here? Hold it! Hold it! You can hardly play! Oh, I play sometimes, when customers demand it. Play your piano now! So I play them one song. That's usually all they want. Because <laughs> I song? suck ass so bad, they don't want me to play anymore Is it... that one song. Is it is it making my way downtown? <laughs> Was that supposed to be a boost just now? No, it's piano, man. 
The title of pianist is a mask. A respectable face I wear to the world at large. Then why are you really at the Borscht Bowl So I could kill that guy. Fuck. To play, to play, to play trombone. <laughs> Got me again, Phoenix Wright. I mean, wait a minute. Uh, take on interested customers. Poker table. They pay you just to play poker? That would seem to be the case. I am a professional, after all. <laughs> Do I detect pride in that statement? It's just hard for an honest, hard-working member of society like me to Shut imagine. Shut the fuck up, dude. Yes, your imagination was always a bit limited, Winston. <laughs> Fucking Damn. burn his Damn. ass. That's incredible. Damn! What? I've played poker for seven years in that little room. And I've never lost once. What? You see why the customers come now? Defeat the undefeated poker champion. It's quite a draw. That is, I'm quite a draw. Wait! All yeah, right. for real. Okay, all right, Phoenix. <laughs> Wait, you've never lost once? Not even one time? As I said, I'm a professional. He's played poker for seven years and not lost once. Is that even possible? Okay, it's the club's main attractions. The room in the crime scene photo is an attraction. It is quite a history, actually. The Borst Bowl Club used to be a gathering spot for black market types back in the day. B black market? All in the past. Things like the black market are only on the silver screen nowadays. Suffice to say that there were a lot of deals being made under the table. Right there in that room. A smoky room. Gambling hoods. You know, just looking at this picture makes me feel bad. The bosses gather around the table, cutting deals, safe from the eyes of the law. Meanwhile, a goon keeps watch through the small window. Chris, Chris is losing it right now. Chris is just goon. going nuts. Chris is gooning right now. I can practically <laughs> picture it now. That little window does look like it would be good for keeping a lookout, but little else. Just like, it looks like it'd be good for goons. <laughs> it's my goon window. <laughs> the room had a few other tricks to it. Well, it... Besides the goon? <laughs> Though it was common knowledge to all our regulars. At any rate, they come to play poker in the room steeped in history. Steeped, steeped with goons. goons. Despite, <laughs> despite the dark past, it was all just good, clean fun. Good, clean that window. Fun. That window had a dark past. Okay, play using two decks of poker. I'm guessing we're going to figure out that one of them doesn't have a blue back and we're like, um, actually, two decks of cards? <laughs> a simple measure to prevent cheating. If you alternate two decks, no one can slip in cards. Yeah, I know all about that when I gamble <laughs> and play poker. I mean, there's something else I noticed. In addition to the cards on the table, there are some lying scattered on the floor. Well, when I killed that guy, he dropped all his cards on the floor. Fuck. <laughs> this is that's because we play 3D poker. <laughs> it's multi-layered poker. Precisely. Cards on the table, cards upon the floor. Each one forming a complete deck. A crime scene painted blue by a sad sweep of cards. It's poetic, really. Incidentally, we use two types of cards in the club. One deck of cards was red, the other was blue. Okay, good. Eh, that's not relevant, I'm <laughs> sure. Hmm. As I recall, in poker, you make five card hands. Not that I would know anything <laughs> about that. I can see how it would be easy to cheat. <laughs> yes, a game of hands. You want these hands? 
wait a minute. I think he's trying to give us a message. Hands. What goes on hands? Gloves. Glover is the killer. <laughs> you gotta love the glove. <clears throat> but if the glove doesn't fit, you must in fact acquit. Yep, that's true. This competition you're talking about. I believe the court understands the nature of the game sufficiently. That's right! It was a simple game, after all. Are you sure? Huh? People are not murdered over simple games, okay. Mr. Justice. Defendant, you were in the room, the room where it happened. The, ro the room, the very moment that the crime occurred. Yet you claim no connection to the crime. Now that's strange. What's strange? I was testifying about the competition that night. Asking me about the crime at this point is against the rules, Your Honor. Of course, I expected to hear a cry of objection from the defense. Ugh! Uh, I completely let that one slip by! Don't despair yet. I do justice. like that Phoenix is like, well, I know how the law works, so uh, I'm going to complain about my lawyer. <laughs> this is fun. I get to be this uh, one this time. This is kind of cool. <laughs> Sir? Right. There's something I'd like made clear. Namely, your connection to the case at hand. And I'd like to hear it from you. Sure. Why not? Very well. The defendant will amend his testimony. Just one little press, and I've got myself a whole new testimony. I mean, it was like four presses, but sure. Uh, I plead silence regarding the murder, but I will say I never touched the murder weapon. Examine. There's the defendant, Mr. Bottle. Wright's finger. There's the def Phoenix. <laughs> wow. He, I know he's too smart to be this dumb, but. Also, wait, check the bottle. Oh! Whoa. They brought back the shit from uh, Rise of Ashes, House of Ashes. Yeah. Yeah, this is the, this is like Apollo Justice's gimmick. Is that it? The bottle is this. completely empty. Okay. I get, I, I'm assuming that's all we can examine on this? Probably. Unless it says something I'll different. I'll be able to examine the label. Grape juice! How long has it been since I drank grape juice? Apparently, it's Mr. Wright's favorite drink. I wonder how well it goes with borscht. <laughs> Just fucking tomatoes and grapes is all this man drinks. Objection! So, you say you didn't touch the murder weapon? This grape juice bottle? Right? So I said. Uh, Something the matter, Mr. Justice? <laughs> Ooh. Too bad our new defense attorney never learned how to play dumb. Watch this, Mr. Payne. I examined the bottle in question, you see. And it was covered with the defendant's fingerprints. I don't I don't think so. Objection! <laughs> no need to shout, Mr. Justice. I can hear you just fine. <laughs> Excess yelling can damage the judge's ears and our my case. voice. But what about my cords of steel? Anyway, anyway. What's so strange about fingerprints on a bottle in a restaurant? Well, uh, that's true. The prints alone don't prove that. Oh, they wouldn't prove a thing if they were normal fingerprints. Huh? But the fingerprints on the murder weapon were upside down. Upside down? Uh, what does that mean? It means he was holding the bottle inverted, and there can be only one reason for that. <gasps> the fucking hair toss! Yes. 
To brain someone with the bottle. To brain wow, someone. they actually <laughs> use the word brain? Oh, I know. In a, in a court of law, to use the term I'm brain, brain you. someone I'm is brain hilarious. I'm to brain this motherfucker. <laughs> The scientific oh! term is for a, assault is brain, because it is a smart thing. Mr. Gavin, I think I think things just took a turn for the worse. Oh, I see no problem, Justin. Huh? The only thing that matters is the truth. There's a good reason for everything. You'll see. Defendant, can you explain your fingerprints on this bottle to the court? <laughs> I stand by my plea of silence regarding the murder. For now. Mm. Not very cooperative, are you? This could hurt your case. I'm sure he's uncooperative because he's hiding something. There must be some reason. Objection! Your Honor, you seem to have forgotten something. And what might that be, Mr. Gavin? On the night of the crime, who was it who reported the murder to the police? Reported? Well, that was the defendant, Mr. Wright. Uh, but still, that... Really? Self-reported? Uh, yes. Well, it's according to the case file, the murder was reported from near the scene by a call from the defendant's cell phone. Oh, man. Near the scene. Yes, he was camping bot lane. Let's take a look at a diagram of the murder scene, oh, shall we? A diagram in the first case, okay. The victim was murdered in a small room in a basement two floors down from ground level. Just in case you didn't know where the body was. <laughs> of course, cell phones can't get reception so far down. The defendant used the stairs in this hallway to go above ground. The call came from the first floor of the restaurant. I see. And this is the phone that made the call. Hey, Nokia. In 2020... What is this, like, set in 2027 or some shit? Yeah. <laughs> The defendant could have just fled the scene of the crime if he, show, if he so chose. Yet, he fulfilled his duty as a citizen and reported it to the authorities. And you claim he is being uncooperative. Uh -huh. Nice save, Mr. Gavin. I'd better not waste this. I think the prosecution has toyed with our client enough for the time being. T toyed? I assure you, no one is more serious about... What was it you said? The defendant was in the room where it happened? In the room the very moment that the crime occurred? How can you possibly know this? That's a good question. How indeed? The answer is simple, Your Honor. The prosecution has a decisive witness. Okay. <laughs> You're as good as they say you are. So someone else was in the room the night of the crime. That must mean they witnessed the crime. Everything up till now has been a warm-up, Justice. Are you ready? Very well. The prosecution may call its first witness to the stand. Oh! Ah, she's, she's cute. The witness will state her name and profession. Uh, hold on just a moment. Where's the witness? I surmise that she has been frightened by the defense's demonic-looking okay. horns. You're gonna call those demon <laughs> that's horns? A good, that's, a good po that's a good point, actually. I mean, realistically, what the fuck is <laughs> up with Apollo? I mean, I guess so many people have just wild anime hair in this, this game, but... Yeah, he's got he's got something about Mary hair. He really does. He really does. So I used a little hair gel! Yeah. Relax, people! Have no fear. If any horns point in your direction, this court will cut them off. <laughs> Shut 
you are sure? I swear it on my gavel. Please so come happy, out. Uh, is it International Coming Out Day today, I believe? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, I think it is. So please come out. Wow. Please come out. Judge is an ally. <laughs> Is it violence against hair a crime, Your Honor? What? Well, if you are sure it is okay. <laughs> baby, absolute baby. Also has a camera gimmick, I guess. Also the camera. Wait a minute. Would the prosecution care to explain the witness's uh, paraphernalia? Uh, yes. She is a professional, Your Honor. Those are merely the tools of her Everybody trade. in this fucking room is a profession. And that would be? She's a professional skis instructor slash photographer slash waiter. My name is Olga Orly. Olga Orly. Olga Orly. Dat. Ol Olga Orly. Oh, yeah, Gorly. Oh, oh, Gorly. I am employed as waitress in Borscht Bowl Club restaurant. Then, why the camera? So I can take pictures of people without them knowing. <laughs> of course, it is my pride to serve Borscht that is naming restaurant. But I also perform. How is it? Other service. And that is... <laughs> so, uh, <clears throat> where is this place again? Uh, and how long are you open? I take it one of these other services is taking the customer's pictures? No, that is a hobby. <laughs> <laughs> da, da. Like, for example, this one. That's the defendant? Indeed. On the night I mean, of the like, murder. We already know they met, like... <laughs> nope, this, this destroys yeah. our case. We're done for now. <laughs> Man in white hat. This one who has gone kaput. Indeed. That is the victim. But wait a minute. You say he's gone to kaput? Where is that? <laughs> order! Order! This is quite a piece of evidence to casually drop it into our lap. It doesn't do anything. <laughs> it is the same way as I drop cold balls of borscht on laps of customers. On casually. their laps? Well, don't do that. Hmm. Then the court will casually accept this new evidence. <laughs> okay. We're having fun sure. here today in the courtroom. Now, witness... Where were you at the time of the murder? I was in room. The hideout, we call it. Excuse me? The hideout? It is room where famous gangster bad guy Fuck was arrested. Off. <laughs> I forgot that's what his name his was. His name <laughs> cannot just be bad guy. There's a there's an assassin named the yeah, Killer. Yeah, sure. So yes, there can absolutely That's, be a bad guy yeah, yeah, named yeah. Bad Guy. Oh my yeah. god! I was gonna say, isn't it the name of the Incredible. character from Guilty Gear, Soul Bad Guy? Yeah. Yeah, but Soul Bad <laughs> Guy is a good guy. guy. Yeah. So it's the whole thing. Yeah, Soul Bad Guy is a good guy. Uh, so. Is room where murder took place? What? <laughs> Your look of utter surprise, it is lovely. I will post my courtroom door later for you. Da, da, photos will be numbered and you will write which ones you want a copy of. So there were nice. three people in the room at the time of the crime. The victim, Shadi Smith, Mr. Wright, and Olga Orly, our witness. If Mr. Wright isn't the killer, that means... <gasps> Very well. Witness, you will testify to the court about that night's events. That fateful night, 
Oh, what a night! That night, customer asked me to deal cards for game. It was cold. Both players played with hats on. Da. The victim, he plays whole time with his hands on locket at his neck. Then last hand is done. But something terrible has happened. Da. That man flew at the victim and is strangling him to death. Why would he be strangling if he's going to hit him with the bottle? <laughs> hmm. Incidentally, who won the game? Isn't it obvious? The winner was the victim, Mr. Smith. Objection! That's ridiculous! <laughs> um, because... Because Mr. Wright can't lose! <clears throat> Justice, maybe you can come up with a... More legitimate just some, objection. Just some constructive criticism for you. But he hadn't lost in seven years. Take it from me, kid. It happens. I didn't lose a case my first seven years as a prosecutor That's either. bullshit. Incidentally, I have some evidence here. Okay. These are the poker chips as they lay the very moment of the crime. The hand and chips on this side belong to the defendant, Mr. Wright. Those on the far side belong to the victim, Mr. Smith. Well, uh, you don't have to be very good, but he has a much better hand. Uh, <laughs> chips, you Judge, say? If you don't know what the fuck Were there chips perhaps... Were there perhaps fish with those chips? <laughs> no. Punch you, punch we you forgot. We're in. <laughs> Did, wrong game, Your <laughs> Honor. Da. I mean, yes. Imagine that poker is what war. What are you? What? Your hand is your army, and the chips are the spoils. Uh, I know that. After all, in my youth, I was known as. The poker head of courtroom number three. Several questions. Um, what? <laughs> Follow-up question. Your youth. Huh? Uh huh? What? <laughs> I think he means... Co followed closely by... <laughs> uh -huh? I think he means poker face. But I hardly even know her. P -p -p poker face, P -p 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 poker did this, did this face. Did get localized around the time of that song dropping? Because I feel like it did, didn't it? No, I think it's before. It's got to be close, though. Hmm. Looking at this picture, it does seem that most of the chips are on the victim side of the table. Uh, poker face comes after a jam. Very well, the defense may cross-examine the witness. Uh, asked me to deal cards for a game. It was cold, they had their hats on. Victim we played the whole time. It's gotta be something with the... Fucking... Flew with the victim strangling him to death. Let's actually read the autopsy report. Single yeah. blow to the forehead. Yeah. Um, uh, yeah, I mean, I kind of feel like we can just present that on this statement. Yeah. yeah. It seems yeah. This doesn't like preclude, wasn't... this doesn't preclude strangulation, but I feel like they, they you feel like they yeah. would have said Mark's found around neck mm -hmm. or something. Oh, yeah. She also says strangling him to death, uh -huh. as in, that's how he died. Oh, uh, yeah. Oh, yeah, Which she does not how he died. Oh, let's look at the back of the phone really oh. quick while we're here. Wow, the batteries are held in with a piece of tape. <laughs> You should just buy a new yeah, one. Yeah, it honestly having having old phones uh -huh. do be like that. Maybe he can't afford it. Or he just doesn't care. Uh it's a really funny piece of flavor text. I love that. Um Is there anything else in this photo that seems interesting? I don't really think so. I got some bottles of grape uh -huh. juice. He's drinking uh, borscht. They got some borscht. Yeah. Also, it looks like there is yeah, at least, actively at least snow now. inside this room, which is a choice. 
I think there is. I think it's supposed. I think it's super cold That's in the room. Fucking wild. Also, Phoenix is wearing sandals. What the fuck? Uh, okay. Autopsy report. Yep. Okay. Cool. We got it. Hey, Olga. <laughs> oh, really? Strangled, you say? That's odd. Da. Normal customers only choke on borscht. No. I, I don't think I want to go to this place. How chunky is your borscht? <laughs> Jesus. No, I mean, this report shows that the victim died of a blow to the head. Uh, Miss Orly. Really? Really now? Did you witness the crime? Uh, that was cute. Ooh. I like that animation. Skills. Hmm. Looking at the picture, it doesn't seem like he was hit. He's still wearing his hat and everything. Yet, it is a fact that he was hit, Your Honor. Oh, damn. Here's a photo we took of the victim with his hat off during our investigation. Well, that's quite shocking, isn't it? This head certainly was hit. <laughs> it's a weird way to mm -hmm. say that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> but I have seen it happen. The defendant, he lunged at the victim, his neck. Oh, really, Mrs. O'Reilly? I think I've caught you in your own lie this time. Justice, I admire your enthusiasm. But perhaps you should think this through one more, this through once more. What do you more. mean? I found a contradiction! There's one thing in her testimony that troubles me. Very well. It seems we should continue the cross-examination. <sighs> There's such a thing as thinking too much. This horse is dead. Let's stop beating it. Okay, I feel like we weren't there yet, but sure, Apollo. There's such a thing as thinking aloud <laughs> too much, too. Uh, wait, so did they change anything? Let's play, play with hats, victim. Look at the locket on his neck. Oh. Oh, is there a locket on he his neck? Doesn't, I bet he doesn't oh, have it not. in this picture. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. No. Nope. Like, I, I think it even looks broken uh, off. But he probably does have it in this picture, does he? Yeah. It's very fucking yeah. small, but he... Yeah, they okay. see it though. Uh, well, so I think I think we needed to do that so we got okay. this picture. Now we and can then press this on. Now we can present, present here. Yeah. Cool. Objection! Nice. You know, there was one curious part in her testimony, just like Mr. Gavin said. But what does it mean, Mr. Justice? Would you care to explain what it is you're thinking so intensely I about? Can just hear him think aloud to himself. Recall the testimony, Your Honor. The victim played with, quote, his hand on locket at his neck. I believe she said. <coughs> I hope you aren't about to raise an objection to the witness's grammar. Oh, I was grammar. very confused why he said it like that. I was like, oh, yeah, because she said it because of her accent that way. No, but fuck me. Look at this photograph! What the hell is on Shadi's head? <laughs> How did his forehead get so red? And why the heck is he dead? <laughs> Do you see a locket on the victim's neck? Well done, Justice. I'm impressed. I knew you'd be able to handle this. But what does it mean? Double rainbow! If we are to believe this witness's testimony as is, then the locket disappeared following the victim's death. Lockets don't just... <laughs> you fucking idiot. Lockets don't just disappear, your honor. Well, Wait, what if really? He, what if Phoenix ate it? He has been known to do that. Yeah, he ate it again. It's quite simple when you think about it. If the locket is gone, someone must have taken it off. No? Taken it off? Wait, you don't mean... The defendant wasn't strangling the victim at all. 
He was taking off his locket. Wouldn't that explain it? Ah. Uh. Defendant, what do you have to say about this? Uh, motherfucker. <laughs> uh, <coughs> Phoenix, you might want to zip that up just a little bit higher, man. Just a little bit higher. <laughs> uh, or like put it behind the shirt or something. It looks a little bad right now for you. Not going to lie. 